Hey everyone, Tamayasu. Welcome to another Artery Gear video. So this is going to be my guide on how to calculate if a pack is efficient or not. Um, and also my spending recommendations for small spenders, um, dolphins, and then whales. So let's take a look at the packs that I recommend everyone to get. Uh, so the first one is, of course, the monthly pass. So the monthly pass is extremely, extremely good because you're getting 1,000 um, crystals every single day plus 60 energy, which is one refill worth. So you're getting 130 crystals worth every single day. And if we do quick maths, that is uh, 39,000 plus the 540. Uh, you're getting $4,444, So the math I'm going to teach you or the conversion I'm going to teach you regarding how to calculate if uh, a pack is efficient or not is one US dollar should be always equal to uh, at least one pull or um, 180 gem equivalent, right? So it's either one red ticket or 180 gem equivalent. So if we look at this one, uh, 4,440 is what you get for $5. Uh, and divide that. Um, so for each dollar, you're getting 888 gems worth, which is mile, mile, miles better than um, one dollar uh, for one pull or 180 gems. And you look at uh, anything else. Uh, this one is pretty good because it's again one to one, pretty much. You get a pull plus uh, 30 gems worth of uh, energy. And uh, this one is even better in value because you get three pulls for one dollar and then three energy. So by doing this, you can see what is worth and what is not. And you can see the weekly is not that worth it because it's 20 and you only get 13 pulls. And uh, these does not add up to uh, $20 worth of pulls. However, looking at this again, it's worth because it's $10 for 10 pulls plus 680 crystals. And uh, this is less in value, but still nice because it's 10 for 10. So this math will always work out and you can calculate, you know, what you're doing um, to see if uh, the money you're spending is great. And then just looking back again, uh, the prime membership. Uh, so this is definitely the best value. After that, it's the union order. So for the union order, you go to purchase order by the advance for $9.99. You get 12 plus 600, which if we're looking at the math, it's uh, 12 times uh let's see 12 times 180 and then plus 600 so 2760 which is double more than double almost triple uh 1099 right plus you're getting all of these other goodies so the uh the pass um union pass is for sure worth it so you always want to get the five dollar monthly pass and then the uh ten dollar union order or union pass battle pass it's uh the best value for your money. And then after that, uh, some of the other recommendations I have is the daily pack, but you buy the seven days version, so it's only $6. And then for $6, you get six pulls, uh, sorry, seven pulls because seven days, plus um, this is five, so five times three, it's 150, because <clears throat> it's 30 gems to refresh, so seven, uh, we do seven times uh, 180 plus, Five times, uh, five times thirty. Uh, my calculator is not okay. Then plus one fifty, basically. Sorry, <clears throat> five times seven is thirty-five. So thirty-five times thirty. Uh, thirty-five times thirty. Oh my goodness, 35 times 30 plus 1260. Okay, there we go. It's about 2000 something. So <clears throat> triple the value uh, is what I'm trying to get at. Almost quadruple, actually. So very, very worth, once again, to get this on the 70 purchase. So it's at a discount because if you buy for one day, it's $1. If you buy for seven, it's only six. Uh, so these three packs, if you can afford it, the monthly pass, union pass, battle pass, and then the weekly are the best value um, that you should get. And then you, of course, want always want to get the free supply box that uh, comes with your levels. And after that, a lot of people ask, do I get the advanced supply box uh, that costs gems? So for the initial early levels, for sure, because um, if you buy a red ticket, it's going to be 180 anyway. So you're getting 
you know, a discount. Uh, around 35 or 30 or maybe even 25, the cost of the uh, tickets uh, will no longer match the cost of gems. So you're paying more gems to get tickets, but they're also throwing things like skin tickets. So then at that point, you know, you have to evaluate if you are going to get skins in the future and you feel like the skin is worth the extra gems that you're going to pay for the tickets. Um, so that is what's going to determine whether or not I get it or not. And then for my whales here, uh, you can grab the T3 crystal. It's for exchanging substats from one gear to another. And uh, initially, you'll be time-gated, so it'd be very difficult to get these. Um, so if you want to buy them every week, uh, you can as well. It's definitely worth it in the first two, three weeks. Uh, so that's pretty much the uh, daily packs. And then the backup energy... Um, also, going back, this is weekly limit. So you see here, it's a weekly limit, but it's in the daily pack. And then for our backup energies, you always, of course, want the free energy. And then in your weekly pack, uh, I sometimes buy this because initially you're just short on energy. But if you do the calculation 38 times um, 30, it's 1140 in terms of gem value. And um, $12 is supposed to give you around uh, 2100 uh, gem value right so it's almost halved um it's not really cost efficient in terms of money per backup energy but it's still at a discounted price versus these energy so basically only the whales will refill these um backup energy packs because there's no restriction you can just keep buying and there's no limit on your stamina um, but for the dolphins you can just get this because it's still at least somewhat cost efficient but not as efficient as some of the other things that uh, grants you pulls. Lastly, we can look at the um, uh, shop. So this shop, again, if we use our quick um, calculation for $79.99, which is let's just say 80, it's supposed to at least give you, um, if each single dollar is worth 180 gems, it's supposed to give you 14,400 gems. So you can see it's not giving you that much um, it's almost 40% less. Um, so even though this is a limit one, it's not 100% worth it, but um, it is worthwhile to get this, especially if you know you're going to whale. So this is for the big spenders um, that are going to get all the packs and plus looking for more. So you want to get all the limit ones, so you can do that. And then at most, you can get the limit threes. So the 9,000 for 79.99. I don't recommend it, but uh, as a whale, obviously this is better than just getting the regular packs with no discount. Um, but you shouldn't really need this unless you're going for max rank ups or you're pulling multiple dupes or you're pitting every single banner. But hopefully uh, you will not need to do that. Yeah, so this is the recharge shop. These limit ones will actually reset around the half anniversary mark and also at the full anniversary mark. So you can whale once again. And that's why I don't recommend, you know, going too far or beyond um, unless you are a heavy, heavy spender. So yeah, that is the basic breakdown. And the same rule will apply to those pop-up deals that try to say, you know, oh, this expires in a few hours. This is such a good deal. So you can see if it's worth or not by just doing some quick maths. So we do five times 180, which is the single pull count plus 610. Um, so this whole thing is worth 1500 gems. If we divide by 180, um, it's supposed to cost $8. Dollars and thirty-eight, right? So this is cost nine dollars ninety-nine. So it's not one to one and uh, not as good of a deal. And if we look at this one, so ten times one eighty plus one thousand one hundred. So this is twenty-nine hundred. Uh, and then we divide it by one hundred eighty, which is the pose worth. Uh, this is supposed to cost sixteen, and it's costing you seventeen. So this one's not too bad uh, compared to the previous one, but of course. Um, in the grand scheme of things, uh, they're not as recommended as some of the, uh, the other packs that you have access to. And of course, the rest are just kind of bad. Uh, if we look at the energy supply, I think maybe the energy supply will be worth. Again, we'll do some testing. 16 times 30 divided by 180. Supposed to cost 266, but it's costing 399. So not worth once again. So yeah, I hope this has been extremely helpful for you, for you to do calculations. Sometimes you don't know a new pack is worth it or not. Um, but uh, one pack that will be always worth it is the collab packs that are limited threes when they happen. It's 
usually $79.99 and you get at least 70 pulls because you can convert the collab tickets. So those are always, always worth and people don't really know about that because they don't convert the um, collab pulls back. Um, so usually if, you know, if you're a whale and you know collab is coming, which we should be getting in a month's time, do save up and uh, try to get grab as many of these uh, mega collab packs as you can. So yeah, that's the minus here. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in the next one.